somebody who's about to start in the industry or looking at the industry, what sort of advice would you give them? Um, first of all, they've got to have a passion yep. for anything you go into. If you've got a passion, you stand a chance of success. Yep. If you don't have a passion, I mean, it always amazes me. There are so many people out there with jobs. They go to each day, come home, you know, they hate it, you know. And I always thought, you know, how on earth can people live their life? Because it takes up a great part of your life. Yes. You know, how can they do that? And I was very fortunate. I just had a passion. I loved what I did. And, you know, it was fascinating. But, you know, that's first thing you've got to have a passion. And, Secondly, I think probably maintain, certainly within the hotel industry, maintain your individuality. Yep. You know, I'm so saddened when I see all these hotels and, you know, they're almost cloning their staff. Their staff are being told what to say, when to say, how to say it. You know, they're not, they don't allow the staff to think for themselves. You know, it's, um, there's one major company that, shall remain nameless and I was staying in the hotel in Hawaii and I was there for five days and I arrived and receptionist greeted me and I thanked them and they said that is my pleasure sir you know the porter took me up to the room and thank you that is my pleasure sir you know the girl who turned down the bed thank you that is my pleasure it was that word thank you sparked off an immediate response that is my pleasure sir the only trouble is it came from every single employee of that hotel and over five days you think, this is rubbish, you know, they don't mean that is my pleasure sir, at all. And the barman, one day I said to the barman, I said, yeah, why do you all say exactly the same thing? Mm. As if like little robots. He said, that's what we're trained to do, sir. You know, he was rather, seemed rather proud of it. He said, oh, we all do that. I said, well, what would happen if you just said, you know, thank you or something more sincere? Oh, we'd probably be fired. And I said, well, you know, Really? Is that what would happen? Said, yeah, I saw. Okay, thanks. And as he walked away, I said, That is my pleasure, sir. And he wasn't being facetious, he was just so programmed. Yep, so conditioned that yeah, it was automatic yeah. response. Yeah. Yep. But no sincerity in it at all. You know, you sort of realize, well, yes, there a computer could do it. Yeah, it's true. It's true.